still a Wednesday. July 27th. Oh, just ate some wonderful sushi with this guy right here. Wave. Yeah. That works. Wonderful guy? Sorry, <laughs> I'll... I'll... <laughs> no, I... I was like, oh, okay. Thanks for the compliment. I like how the blue handicap thing almost blends in with the black asphalt. You talking about the painting of the... Yeah. <coughs> the road. Yeah. The entrance or whatever the hell you want to call it. Death trap for the disabled. Yes, you must speed up to make the light. So you think this guy either wants to hit a duck with a hockey stick or hit a duck with a golf club? Um, it's an interesting dilemma. I don't think he's a mighty duck, whatever they're called now, fan. It look like that. Oh, you mean Disney sold them? Well, it's been a long time, I believe. Yeah. Wow, that guy was whole ass. Yeah. They still have a ratty old Mighty Duck t-shirt from like their first season. <coughs>
understand is putting a, a debt committee, basically a super committee of Congress that would go back and look at entitlement programs and tax, uh, the tax reform later on in the process. Those are built in almost identical fashion. The parts of the budget these guys are looking at are the same. So uh, I think the differences between the two plans can be, can be easily overstated. One certainly is that the Boehner plan calls for a two-step pr procedure, uh, which would mean that this would all come up again before next year's elections. That's right. The, the Boehner plan, as it's written, would be uh, basically $900 billion debt limit increase up front. Uh, that would require probably in about six months for, for Congress to come back and raise the debt ceiling again. In order to do that, he would condition that on uh, another package of uh, deficit reduction, probably some set of tax reforms in the title. Like clockwork. I'll tell you. Oh, yeah. I'm just pretty much always guarantee that someone's just going to roll right through the fucking line. Right? Oh, no. You're talking about the traffic. I was listening to the radio. Oh, that too. I mean, you can pretty much see what the fuck they're going to do, which does not accomplish anything at all, but make sure that they continue to receive whatever the hell it is to keep them alive. Seems to be a sense of confidence on Capitol Hill. 